All right, so I just got me a generator. 3,500, 50 running watts, and maximum 5,250. Got four household plugs, and then the normal uh, 240 volt circular. I had a special adapter made for that circular plug to power that big monster air conditioner right there, because that's what I wanted to use it for. It's pretty, pretty sweet. It's made by, it's a generic, but I guess that's part of Troy Built. It's pretty nice. So basically, what I did, a little bit of electrical work here basically converted the 20 amp NEMA L14-20R which is provided on the generator needed a male connector end on it and then on the other end would be the 20 amp NEMA 6-20R plug for the air conditioner so there's a the connector for the generator, and there's my connector for the air conditioner. It's a 25 foot cable for uh, to run the extension piece. Well, I'm going to go ahead and fire this thing up, and we'll see if it can handle the load of a big 18,000 BTU air conditioner. All right, go ahead and plug this in. Twisted in, locked in, and we'll connect the air conditioner connector. All right, we are set. And we'll go ahead and crank it up. I was told by a few electricians that making this type of adapter to run because it's got two hots, a neutral, and a ground, and then converting it to a three prong, basically two hots and a ground. I get that off there. That it wouldn't be to code. Well. I don't really need it to code because this is going to be going to Mexico and down there codes really <laughs> don't exist. Uh, but yeah, power goes out a good bit down there and there's really nothing that can power something this strong unless you have special wiring done for the house and that costs a good bit of money down there so um, but yeah, that's uh, basically the sole purpose. All we did was tie the neutral in to the ground, so that way it's, it is properly grounded and it works just fine. So, yeah, neat little experiment that's a success.